Okay, guys, you here, right? Hey, G, you know, welcome to another GTA 5 Car V Car episode. I know it's been a while since I've posted this episode, but hey, we're back now with the series. I finally managed to get a working controller for the PlayStation 3 to record some footage. If you guys are enjoying the series and show some support, make sure you guys slap the like button. Let's try and get 1,000 likes. That'll be greatly appreciated. So let's get right into it with Franklin's Buffalo against the normal Buffalo. Highly request in the previous episodes. Starting off with the drifting with Franklin's Buffalo. I thought at first this one was going to smack the normal Buffalo out of the window, but it turned out that drifting was a struggle with this car and i realized that this car was much heavier compared to the normal buffalo so uh in that sense it was much uh, more difficult to maneuver certain drifts with franklin's buffalo it turned out the buffalo was much easier itself the normal buffalo that is to drift with and it was in fact much better with the results as well with the longer drifts and easier drifts and uh better drifts to pull off so definitely a point there for the normal buffalo without a doubt but handling it turned out it was much easier for Franklin uh, to handle the car, obviously, with a comparison to the Buffalo, the normal Buffalo, that is. Uh, it's just uh, easier to uh, get back in control after drifts and whatnot. And of course, the, just the general feel of the car is much better compared to the normal Buffalo, I feel. So definitely a point going towards handling for the Franklin's Buffalo. And this is definitely, uh, it's very tight, you know, because both these cars are similar to each other when it comes to performance. So it was very difficult to choose which one is better than the two. But for sort of shotgun durability test, this one was another surprise for me. In fact, uh, you know, turned out the normal Buffalo, I believe it took around, uh, yep, 12 shots. Yeah, 12 shots. And uh, Franklin's Buffalo took around 10 shots, which actually baffled me at first. Because you'd expect Franklin's Buffalo to be more durable than the normal Buffalo. But in this case, it wasn't. So the point goes towards the normal Buffalo. Moving on towards the head-on collision damage. This one wasn't a surprise and it was straightforward and the normal Buffalo in fact took slightly more damage than the Franklin's Buffalo but they were pretty close I must say. I had to get a couple other guys to get some uh, you know, perspective onto that to get the answers to this particular test. So currently 2-2 but for the best customization for Franklin's Buffalo for sure without a doubt. I don't even have to show you the normal Buffalo because normal Buffalo hardly has any customization whatsoever. So 3-2 currently for Franklin's Buffalo for the fastest car. Franklin's Buffalo just took off and you'd expect this some way or another as uh, even before you do the test Franklin's car is just without a doubt a pretty fast car in general and when you compare it to the normal Buffalo you'd expect this to be fast regardless so definitely a point slapping on there to make it 4-2 for Franklin's car and uh, yeah this one definitely was an expected episode in my opinion but definitely a couple of surprises there but for the fourth gear test this one you'd expect uh, yet again Franklin's Buffalo to do pretty well for acceleration, but you never know. But 8.16 seconds for Franklin's Buffalo, and we can see even normal Buffalo here. It should be pretty tight. Uh, definitely for acceleration, it's pretty close when it comes to similar cars. But in this case, uh, I was uh, about, about a second slower, so 9.09 .09 second there. But faster brake time, both of these cars were in fact similar to each other. So currently, so we're making it 6 3, so in total, you know. Franklin's Buffalo taking an extra three points there. So, you know, this episode wasn't really surprising with a couple of tests. I wasn't really expecting the results there. But other than that, you'd expect Franklin's Buffalo to be pretty pretty good there. So anyway, I don't really see... I, I, I want to say which one would be your favorite because uh, I'd say pro probably everyone would choose the Franklin's Buffalo instead. But definitely let me know what other episodes you guys want to see in the comment section below. I'll be uh, reading through them yet again and, of course, uh, making them for you guys. So, I'll see you guys soon. Shaggy is out. Good night. Peace. Yeah! Oh, if you guys missed out the previous episode, the Imponte Phoenix was going against the Rona. That was a pretty interesting episode as well. So, definitely check out our annotation on the screen. Click that. It will take you straight to the video. Thanks for watching. <laughs>